First open our Grazie app. If you already have an account, give the login credentials and click login. If you don't have an account, you can create an account by clicking here. I don't have an account, so I am going to create an account. Give a username, valid email address, and password. Now this is the dashboard of our Grazie app. You can know the printer information from the Get Started section. If you want to print any document or picture simply go to the Document Print section and create labels according to your needs from the Label Print options. If you need any kind of software or app you can download from the Software Download section, watch our product videos from here. You can also find out the full product details in the Recommended Product section. Here you will find a chat option to connect with our customer support team. If you will face any kind of issue, please knock us from here. Our customer support team will help you. Now let's discuss the document print section. Select any document from here. Here is the interface for printing preferences. You can customize the print size, print page, and rotation from here. After setting up the printing preferences, click the print button. It will redirect you to the print preview page. Here you need to connect the printer by Bluetooth. Click on here and find out your printer name with MAC address and click on that to connect. You can control the printing copy, print density, and print speed from this page. If everything is okay for you then hit the print button again. You can also open any document from WhatsApp, mail etc. with our app and can print it. Now let's discuss the label print section. Here you will find two sections. One is the model, which has some templates for printing purposes. You can directly choose any kind of template according to your label size for print. Suppose I want to use this template. Click on the template and click edit. You can change anything for your labels. Suppose I want to make this $230 to $200. So double tab on it right $200 and click confirm button. Here you will find a lot of options in the template option. I will discuss them in the create label section. If you want to save this template, you can save it by clicking the save button. I'm going to save it. Click on save and you need to put the name of the template. Suppose I give a name like example. The template is successfully saved and you will find the saved template in recent usage. You can use your created template in the future for easy printing. Let's click here to print the saved template. You can also delete the template by clicking the delete button. So click on edit for further process. Click on the print button. Connect your device with the app and if the printing properties are okay for you then click on the print button. Another option for label printing is to create the label. You can create your own labels from here. First, select a printer from here. Now give your label height and width and hit the OK button. Now draw your labels here, and here you will find lots of tools for creating labels. If you want to write only text, click here. Double click on the box and type your text. You can customize your text like font size and font style from those options. You can also delete and rotate from here. If you want to add more things, click on the template. Now if you want to give a barcode, click here. You can customize this section also. If you have a barcode number then put it here. And you can also choose the barcode type from here. Now click on the template again. If you want to take a QR code, you can also write a QR code by clicking here. Same thing as the barcode you can customize this. Now I'm removing all of them. If you want to delete anything, just click on the design and click on the delete button. If you need any kind of tabular form, click here. You can create a table from those options. You can add images from here. Click here. 
You can choose images from your gallery. And also you can take images instantly. Let's take a picture. You can also customize the taken picture as per your needs. I'm cropping the image and taking the specific area that I need to print for now. You can scan any barcode or QR code to create any label. You will find lots of emoji from emoji tools. If you need any kind of shape or draw line, draw them from here. I'm drawing a circle shape. Click the circle from the figure type. If you need to increase the figure width you can also do it. Now, if you have different kinds of color label paper then you can select them from our app, and can also view the design part from here. Suppose, I have this color paper, so I'm taking this background and designing my label. Also, it will automatically resize your printing size. This background only previews your label purpose, and how it looks after print you can see this here. If you are ready with your label, then click on the print button and take a look at the printing properties. If everything is okay for you click print. That is all for today, we will discuss more in the next video. If you need any kind of assistance, don't forget to knock us through chat support in the app.